You're watching CI Living at home in your community. All right, time now to take a look at what's trending. Yeah, we've collected a few of our favorite stories you've seen over this weekend. All right, first up. Yes, okay, this is a sweet story. An eight-year-old learned his Waffle House waiter was living in a motel, and he raised over $100,000 for him. Eight-year-old Kazen Hunter was a breakfast regular with his family and sometimes grandpa at the local Waffle House in Little Rock, Arkansas. With these trips comes his meal served by his favorite waiter, Devonte Gardner, and the waiter shares that every Every time Kazen comes in, he's always ready with a high five, and he has even memorized Kazen's usual order, scrambled eggs with cheese, no toast, hash browns covered with cheese, and an Arnold Palmer. And of oh. course, they developed such a bond that he felt the need to help him and support him by raising the, that money for him. So, pretty oh. cool story. And that smile says it I all, know, right? right? There. What Very a, sweet. What a sweet kid with a sweet heart. Yeah. Yeah. Help people. others. Yeah, that's right. Okay, up next, maybe not so sweet, maybe not as good as those scrambled eggs, um, but for some moms, an umbilical cord is a reminder of the birth of their baby. But why are we suddenly seeing preserved parts all over social media? With um, when Megan Kilpatrick was getting ready to welcome her daughter, she knew she wanted to encapsulate her placenta. <laughs> it's a process that includes steaming, dehydrating, and grinding the placenta before placing it into pills for ingestion by postpartum moms. But then she learned about umbilical cord keeps keep keepsakes. Oh my word! <laughs> Where umbilical cords can be preserved and um, in gold or rose. Uh, gold covered in the shape of a little heart there. This is a California-based mom, and she says she was initially caught off guard by the concept, but after watching the video, she thought, oh, it's only 20 bucks. <laughs> That's it's pretty good a deal. good deal. <laughs> so she left the hospital with a cooler to properly preserve her placenta before shipping it to a company for the encapsulation process. Okay. No, thank you. Oh, you wouldn't want this for them? Absolutely <laughs> not. What, what am I going to do with that? I know, and I've seen even some people wear it as like necklaces. You know, but to each their own. Yeah, if that's you know, your thing. If that means a lot means. to you, absolutely, absolutely. I mean, I guess if you are eating it as a pill, it was inside of you. It's not like it's... But it's still just the thought. Yeah, it is a thought for me. Yeah. I just think it's like graphic and then you're putting it, but to some, I guess yes. it's beautiful. So yes. go you if that's you. All right, <laughs> next up, some kindergartners dream of becoming the next Disney princess. Oh. Um, and some have someone much different in mind. For five-year-old Essie Hewitt of Atlanta, Georgia, she instead has her eyes on becoming more like the longest serving first lady of the United States, Eleanor Roosevelt. <laughs> <laughs> Last month, her mom, Liz Hewitt, headed to TikTok with a series of videos to break down a school event where her daughter dressed as Eleanor Roosevelt. And the first TikTok has racked up nearly 50,000 views and shows Essie hilariously appearing to hype herself up while donning a stern expression in an outfit inspired by the late first lady. Her mom stated in a post, my five-year-old was Eleanor Roosevelt for the President's Day thing at school. And ever since she put on that costume, she has not taken it off, which has now almost 4.3 million views of that video. And in the video, Hewitt is visibly beside herself as she goes onto the list of the various asks that her daughter has <laughs> made in the name of her new passion. Her request includes an Eleanor Roosevelt themed birthday party, a stuffed version of the first lady to sleep with that night, and then the name. In one of the TikTok videos that mom shares that Essie has asked that she refer to her as your ladyship from now on. Wow, she is embracing the character Isn't for that sure. So funny. Oh I my hope, gosh. I hope she got an A plus. You sure think so. That is outstanding. <laughs> She's living and breathing the role, that's for sure. Wow, of all the people you could pick. I know. Respectable. Well, okay, and finally, a pelican in peril? Huh. Wow, this one's spotted in the snow in South Lake Tahoe. Um, looking lost, cell phone video captured the effort to rescue it. Two men able to corner the big bird as it flaps its enormous wings. Gosh. The rescue attracting more and more onlookers. The American white pelican was likely making an early trip. Um, when witnesses say it had a power line. Poor Aww, thing. Poor thing. It was treated, fed, and ready to be returned to the wild. Gosh. So, very cool. Yes. All right. Hey, if something else is trending, let us know. Maybe yeah. we'll share it here. Because